Hello guys, how's everyone? I hope you guys are always fine. Our topic for today is all about a life cycle of a butterfly. I started researching about caterpillars because they always make my plant leaves bald and ugly and it upsets me. So I just thought I need to know more about them just to compromise me. Butterflies are not only fun to watch, but they serve a critical purpose as well. Butterflies and other pollinators, including bees, moths, birds and bats, pollinates over 75% of the world's flowering plants. We depend on what these pollinators do to help plants reproduce, which helps strengthen ecosystem and maintain life-sustaining biological diversity in nature. Before we head on to our main topic, I will share you some fun facts about caterpillars. Caterpillars number one job is to eat. Caterpillars has 12 eyes. They have three body parts, head, thorax, and abdomen. Caterpillars are harmless. Caterpillars are insects. They have lots of legs, but only six are true. They don't have lungs, they don't have teeth, and caterpillars can find in our garden. Look for caterpillars on the underside of leaves of their host plants. Some will hide during the day in shelters of leaves and grass and only feed at night. They are displaying their large eye spots to deter predators like birds and large insects from eating them. Caterpillars have 12 eyes. These eyes are arranged in a semicircle from one side of the head to the other. However, they do not result in excellent vision as the caterpillar is unable to see an image or visualize colors. Only after research, I got an understanding on why caterpillars ended up finishing off my houseplants. It's because butterfly chose to lay eggs on the plant leaves of my plants, so it's not the caterpillar's fault anyway. And here's the life cycle of the butterflies. Once finding the right plant, the female butterfly will lay her eggs, usually on the underside of leaves, but sometimes under loose bark or in mulch near the host plant. They hatch into baby caterpillars, also called the larva. When the eggs hatch into tiny caterpillars, the food is all around them and they can start eating immediately. The caterpillar first feeds on the eggshell from which it is born. It then starts feeding on the leaves and starts to grow. 
The caterpillar sheds its skin several times so that it can grow. Once the caterpillar is big enough, it stops eating. It then forms a protective layer around itself. This stage is called chrysalis. In this stage, the caterpillar now is called pupa. Inside the chrysalis, the pupa undergoes a series of changes. The pupa remains motionless in the chrysalis. After about 15 days, a beautiful adult butterfly emerges out of the chrysalis. When the butterfly comes out, its wings are small and wet. The butterfly pumps fluids into its wings to make them strong and to expand. After a few hours, the wings become strong enough and the butterfly is able to fly. This series of changes in the life cycle of a butterfly is called metaphormosis. And here is some trivia. What is the meaning of a butterfly flying around you? Seeing butterflies symbolizes a big transformation and personal growth. Butterflies are flying around to point you to see life more carefree. Try to look at a situation in a lighter way. Don't take your life for granted. That's maybe the most important message that butterflies are bearing. That's all for today. I hope you like this video. It would mean the world to me if you will subscribe. And please don't forget to like and hit the notification bell. Marami pong salamat. Till next. Bye!